Hey guys and welcome to another video. Today it's another q and I can't believe I want you doing this again <laughs> because uh, I mean it, it's been a while since the you know since I did this you know the third one I know third one was quite a bit of a distance for the second one I mean look at this look at the this. but at the same time I mean doing this Q&A which will be awesome because I know I've uh, got some more questions and uh, top lad <laughs> Nigel Know how that dad looked because I didn't look at the camera. But anyway, we're going to start doing these questions because I don't want to waste any time. Plus, uh, yeah, I, I allegedly kind of wait to do these. <laughs> so the first question I want to talk about is uh, if you had to choose a new replacement for a limb you've lost of your choice, what would you replace it with using the hospital's limited? Oh, I already read that one. Limited medical supplies, a dead pigeon, a unwashed plate that was used a, as a murder weapon, a crime and a crime and a coke bowl filled with bits of your old limb of choice with flies and maggots or a dog with half a head who is alive but can't walk because it cough really extremely loud. I don't know what the fuck. How many cats have you tried to steal? Me. How many cats have tried to steal from you in the last 25 minutes of human history? <laughs> None. Because I hate cats. Quack. Quack. <laughs> Fucking quack. Don't worry. Don't worry, guys. Don't worry, guys. I'll leave you. Do you identify as a Chinese food shop and do you like old round Chinese women who smell like cats and s who smoke cigarettes? If your legs only worked on weekends and your whole body only worked on weekdays, how would you live? My god. If my legs only worked on weekends, oh my god. But what work would I do though? That's the thing. I'd have to, I'd have to be in a wheelchair in the weekdays. It's like faking being disabled. Why? If you had to marry GTA San Andreas, why would you even do that? The fuck? If you found out you were a chronic what the if you found out you were a chronic paracetamol addict, <laughs> how would you break the news to everyone? Well, if I was a paracetamol addict, I'd be like, I of pain. If you had to live in a dog on... What the fuck? If you had to live... If you had to live in a dog on crack, how would you keep the dog in place to live in it without killing it or hurting it? <laughs> the fuck? I don't know, I just found this comment, just scrolling down. No, you don't knew Dr. Way at it leaves I cluck for the queen. There's the thumbnail for the video. Anyway, thank you guys so much for watching this q and I know it's probably a bit short one. I'll probably try and make this longer in post-production. But anyway, hopefully we'll be able to see more Q&As in the future. As always, I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye-bye!